Hey, welcome to another week of First and Vaughn. In tonight's episode, I'll be recapping what has happened in NFL up to this point. Veteran quarterbacks left the field for the booth. Jay Cutler showed off something you'll want. Uh, I don't know if you want to see that. Beast Mode returned, another team moved, a VCU Ram is now in the NFL, and Chet Otocinco is now playing in the Mexican Football League. All the roster moves and much more. Here we go. This is first and Vaughn, this is first and Vaughn, this is first and Vaughn, you know. I am the first of Vaughn NFL analyst and your host, Jacob Vaughn. Behind the camera is our producer, RJ Thomas, who's going to kick us off into our first segment of the night. Ooh, the Elite. <laughs> the Elite segment this week will be a list of my top five off-season moves. And starting with number five is the Jaguars pairing star cornerback A.J. Boye with the uprising Jalen Ramsey. Their secondary went from good to great in just one signing. You can never have too many quarterbacks in this league. And at number four is the Texans dumping Brock Osweiler. The experiment came to a quick ending as Brock was traded to the Browns after being a 72 million guaranteed quarterback. And coming in at number three is Marshawn Lynch coming out of retirement. Beast mode returned home to the Oakland Raiders. He will have a great year after taking a year off and he's behind the Raiders offensive line, no doubt. The best team in the league is at number two, the New England Patriots, trading all their picks for veterans. They trade for great players like Brandon Cooks, Coney Ely, and Dwayne Allen. And they also signed Mike Gisley and Stephon Gilmore. And the number one offseason move so far is the New York Giants, signing Brandon Marshall for cheap. OBJ, Sterling Shepard, and now Brandon Marshall? Wow. The NFC East better be prepared to guard one of the most dangerous wide receiver combos in the league. What's next? will leave you scratching your head. Here are my favorite stories from the offseason so far. We'll work our way up to the list, but first is Jay Cutler. He and his wife went on a vacation trip and he buried it all on social media. No, I'm, not, I'm not even gonna look at that. RJ, uh, yeah, you can, whatever. I feel as if this picture just sums up Jay Cutler's whole career. Tony Romo formally retired and took his talents to CBS to become an NFL broadcaster. Since this is my show, Tony Romo is overrated and not a Hall of Famer, and he always chokes in the big moments. But I do respect him since he was undrafted. Jay Cutler actually followed what Tony did and went to the booth to join Fox as an NFL broadcaster. Probably because the teams didn't want Jay Cutler walking around like he was in that picture. I guess VCU having an undefeated football team finally paid off. VCU basketball star Mo Ali Cox held a tryout to show off his talents for NFL teams, and 30 out of the 32 teams came to watch him work out. Mo Ali Cox was signed by the Colts, and VCU does not have a football team, just to remind you all. Now we have an NFL player. As he enters rookie training camp, we wish him the best of luck. The story I've been waiting to share all show. Ched Ochocinco, Ched Johnson. He is now playing in the Mexican Professional Football League. Probably as a confidence boost, I would guess. But here's the clip of how tough Chet Ochocinco's competition really is. Ahora, a Choy Cantú, ahí vemos como el movimiento que hace deja totalmente sin oportunidad a Choy Cantú. Y lo demás, pues es simplemente atrapar el balón y festejar de una manera. To me, those players look like they're trying to either gain attention from Ched or Ched is just playing an empty stadium against kids he is watching while their parents are at work. If you want to know all the top offseason moves, stay tuned. Jacob's offseason. I'll be recapping all the top moves so far so you can stay up to date on your team or favorite players. Here are the roster moves you need to know. I'm going to go quick, so grab your notebooks and your pencils. All these moves can be found on my Twitter page, Javon Sports. Here we go. Eddie Lacy signed with the Seahawks. RG3 is released by the Browns. Don Terry Poe was signed by the Falcons. Jamal Charles was signed by the, his rival, the Broncos. Nick Foles eventually returned to the Eagles. Geno Smith without a broken jaw signed with the Giants. Latavius Murray signed with the Vikings. Alshon Jeffrey signed with the Eagles. Demarcus Ware retired. The Oakland Raiders moved to Vegas. Kenny Britt signed a monster deal with the Cleveland Browns. And speedy Deshaun Jackson Signed with the Buccaneers. Quarterback turned wide receiver Terrell Pryor. Signed with the Washington Redskins. Vikings released Adrian Peterson, who then signed with the Saints. The Seahawks attempted to trade Richard Sherman. Texans future Hall of Famer wide receiver Andre Johnson retired. Logan Allen. Dang, Logan Allen. Yeah, my boy Logan Allen. Hey! 
<laughs> Logan Ryan left the Patriots and signed with the Titans. Marcus Wheaton signed with the Bears, and veteran Calais Campbell signed with the Jaguars. And it's now time to close out another week of First and Vaughn. Here are the final results of last week's fan poll. Hmm, those results are interesting. But RJ, I'm going to lean with the fans on this one. This week, vote to let us know which player you are looking forward to seeing in their new uniform the most. As usual, use hashtag First and Vaughn and follow us on all of our social media outlets. I'll see you all soon. Enjoy this nice summer weather. Sam Fleming, close us out. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for tuning in today. Uh, this is First and Vaughn. You know this show is bomb. Jacob's out here dabbing like he's Cam Newton. He's reporting on the NFL. He's the number one analyst. He's speaking facts and haters can't handle it. But the real animal is RJ. When he has the camera, you know it's a parte. He be filming and shooting, making these reels like a movie. Editing scenes, he's the greatest cameraman. You can't refute it. Oh, oh, this is first and Vaughn. Oh, oh, this is first and Vaughn. Oh, oh, this is first and Vaughn. This is first and Vaughn. This is first and Vaughn, you know.